So part two, I left 7-Eleven, had to drive all the way back to a Wawa where the air was actually free. The reason why I stopped at 7-Eleven was because it was close to where I was at and I just didn't want to drive, you know, with the tire being low. But God is good. I made it to Wawa and finally made it to my destination only to realize I left my bag at home. So <laughs> I had to leave the spot where I was. Oh, I had to go all the way back home. And now I'm heading back to my destination. You know, obstacles, they come. And it's, it's frustrating. It's annoying. But I, I have to accomplish this goal that I set out for myself today. I'm going to do it. And so even though there are obstacles, I just have to persevere. Remember in the other video where I said you have to treat yourself better than how they have treated you. And I find that sometimes we go all the way out for other people. There's nothing wrong with helping other people. But do we go all out for ourselves? Do we go all out for our businesses? And so this is something that I wanted to do today. And I had some obstacles. But I don't care. I don't care. I'm going to persist. I am going to overcome. I'm going to achieve my goals that I've set for myself as a successful entrepreneur as a gifted individual and so no matter the warfare i will continue to go forward and not backward i will continue to accelerate i will continue to excel i will continue to fight right i will continue to believe in myself believe in you know what god has called me to do and never stop and I will do that on repeat. I was made to fight and to win. But you had to fight the right way. And so, yep, I'm going back to my destination. And I will keep you posted. So, obstacles or no obstacles. <laughs> keep on doing what God told you to do on repeat. And put a big smile on your face. <laughs> Enjoy the ride. Never give up. <laughs>